So now we're looking at how to graph linear equations by using the intercepts. Uh, the process for this is essentially the same as it was before, only instead of choosing uh, our first two points, we use the intercepts. We use y equals 0 and then solve for x. We use x equals 0 and then solve for y. That gives us our two intercepts. And then we choose one other x value to find one other point. So we have three points to go through to make sure that we didn't make a mistake with either of our intercepts. So we'll start off looking for the x-intercept. Again, that's when y equals 0. So we plug in y equals 0. We get x minus 2 times 0 equals 4. 2 times 0 is just 0, so we end up with x equals 4. So our x-intercept is the point 4. 0. Now for the y-intercept, that's when x equals 0. So 0 minus 2y equals 4. So that's just negative 2y equals 4. We divide both sides by negative 2, and we get y equals negative 2. So the y-intercept is 0, negative 2. So we'll go ahead and let's use x equals negative 2. So our third point, and you can use any x value that you want. So x equals negative 2, so negative 2 minus 2y equals 4. Add 2 to both sides. We get negative 2y equals 6. Divide both sides by negative 2. And we get y equals negative 3. So when x equals negative 2, y equals negative 3, which gives us the point negative 2, negative 3. So now we plot our three points. 4, 0 for the x-intercept. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 0. 0, negative 2 for the y-intercept. And negative 2 negative 3, negative 1, negative 2, negative 3 for our third point. And there we have the graph of x minus 2y equals 4.